again everyone welcome to this tutorial and in this tutorial we're going to be making a fabric background so you could use this as a backdrop for your photographs or whatever you want really but it's just a simple tutorial I picked up somewhere on the internet I thought I'd share it with you so uh, let's get started so first off we need to go file new and name our new document something like f well, know, fabric or something like that, whatever you want to call it red fabric blue fabric because you can change the colors of them click OK let me just size it up a bit so we can see what we're doing like so a bit smaller that's it right so what we need to do next is make sure we've got our default colors on black and white and then we need to click on our uh, gradient tool make sure you've got your mode set as difference and your opacity to 75 now all you need to do now simply is click on your gradient tool like so make sure you've got black and white uh, let's have a look and then click OK and then all you do is just basically drag across like so backwards and forwards that's all you do and you're going to get a different effect each time there obviously you can decide on how many times you want to do it but I mean until you see something that you like and then once you've done that all you need to do next is go to image adjustments color balance and with then this little box pops up and with your color balance you just pick what color you want let's give it a bit of color now if you want a bit of red sign whatever you want that looks pretty cool so I mean there you have it it's that simple really so that's one fabric now obviously there's a number of ways of doing this let's go back what you can use it for I suppose is photographs and stuff for backdrops if the ba damaged background for your photographs is damaged you just put that if it's got a background for a bit of a fabric you can use that also you can do it a diagonal way as well um, oh, sorry undo that made a bit of a mistake there and basically all you would need to do is the same thing really and then you can get a bit of diagonal uh, diagonal fill to your to your uh, fabric say something like well I mean you can spend a bit more time I mean than what I'm doing so say something like that and then you've got yourself image adjustments color balance and uh, you just put your your color balance in like so now if you want to have that a little bit of blue like so or green or whatever color you like so I hope this helps you out I mean it's going to come in useful I think and very handy so hope you enjoyed this tutorial thanks very much for watching bye for now